Welcome everyone. This is just a, a quick video of how there's a request regarding the uh, Kindle. Uh, the, the, the persons are struggling to get ebooks onto their Kindle, so I'm going to show you how I do it. Okay, so this works on iOS or Android. I'm using an Apple, so it's going to be iOS I'm showing you on. Okay. So, what you need to do is, first and foremost, you need to download the Kindle app onto your phone. So, that's it. Uh, there, yeah. So, it's the wee blue screen with the image of a person silhouette reading a book. Okay, that's what you do. Download that to your phone. And once you've downloaded it to your phone, okay, link it up to your Amazon account, the same as what you've done with your Kindle, because that's been linked up to your Amazon account, all right? And then what we do is, you can go to any site you wish for any free ePubs. Um, Kindle itself uses Mobi files, that's M-O-B-I, so you can look up Mobi files free for Kindle. Just Google it. Put it into a search, any search engine, free EPUB, and you'll get a list of them. The one I'm going to show you today is Project Gutenberg. Okay, so I'm going to be doing this now on a screen on my phone, and then I'll do a voiceover explaining what I'm doing. Okay, so let's go do it. Right, so I'm opening up the Chrome app, and as you can see, I'm going to Project Gutenberg. So I open that up. Now on this website, there's a few ways you can do things, but for this I'm going to go to Search and Browse, and I'm going to look for a specific book called Dracula. So I'll type Dracula in, and then I hit Search. And there it is there, Dracula by Bram Stoker. So I'm now going to download that one on, you see, EPUB 3. Okay, there it is downloaded. And now you just open it up and where you've downloaded it to. Now you click and hold on this to get your menu up and you have to rename this. So you hit the rename and just type in Dracula. And then done. Once that's done it again, you go back to the book and hold again onto it to bring the same menu up. And this time you're looking for share. Touch the one where you see the Kindle app. Now, you, you can see that the Dracula is the title, but you can, if you wish to, change the author. So I'll put in Bram Stoker. And then just hit send. And that's it. It's done. Close your phone down. Now you open up the Kindle app. And you'll see it's not in here. So what you've got to do is go to the home and hit sync. Now, give it a minute or so before you do this. I've got quite impatient with this. So as you see, I've hit the sync. I'll go back to the main menu for the library. Right. And it's not there. So I need to go back to home again and resync. These docs there, you see, they're books I've previously downloaded and I've not opened yet. So we'll sync again. And then again, back to home. Nothing's changed, so it's still not there. Okay, but don't panic, because third time lucky, it'll probably work this time. So I'll sync it again. And this time now, when I go back to home, you'll see 
So I'm going to go back to the very start of what are the books. And there you go. There's a new doc file, Dracula. So you open that up, and there it is. That's it now into your Kindle. And there you go, there's the cover. So what you do now then is just go back now and open your Kindle up. So I hope you're still with us on this. Now once you've done all that, okay, that should now be that book set up on your Kindle app on your phone. So if you wake your Kindle up, all right, and push the downward arrow, okay, and then you'll see this one here that says sync, touch sync, hit your up arrow, oh, and there it is there, Dracula, open it up, let it download, once it's downloaded, you get the photo of the book in, open the book, and there you go. Easy peasy. <laughs> <laughs> so, I hope that's been of some help. You can do that format with any EPUB book that you find that's free. Okay? Um, also, you can look up Mobi. That's M-O-B-I. That's the type of format that the Kindle actually uses. So, all that said and done, hope that's been a help. If it is, smash that thumbs up. If you're new, welcome to Random Therapy. I'll see you in the next one. I'll see you there.